Greetings everyone, Looney Farm Guy here with an update video for the extended oil plant mod by Jump Fruit 4.94 megabytes to download. It's for all platforms and there has been an extensive list of updates to this particular mod. Now, I must say um, uh, that the modder has been in contact with me to, through texting or not texting but messaging anyways and I want to thank um, Jump Fruit for um, contacting me letting, letting me know that there's update coming to look for it and um, so we're going to go through this um, fairly detailed um, <clears throat> because he has done quite a bit uh, of changes to this and um, we're going to look at everything now first of all this is a modification of the base game um, oil production so we'll find it under production and here it is here uh, the no not the grain mill uh, 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 there it is extended oil plant uh, it's uh, eighty thousand dollars I did not take note of the uh, slots. I do believe the slots are the same as the original uh, original before the update. So there you go there. And it also comes with a selling point. Um, grain mill. No, no. There it is. Extended oil. $1,000. And that will uh, facilitate the selling of the production products as well as other products too so <clears throat> uh one note okay let, let's let's read the changelog notes first added soybean oil so that's significant because and uh, i'm just going to interject something here there was something that used soybean oil another different mod um not too long ago and trying to figure out where do you get soybean oil from well <clears throat> now we know um, <laughs> we can have uh, we have soybean oil now uh, along with uh, a few others so um, soybean oil has been added the prices of canola oil and sunflower oil have been increased we'll look at that fixed issue with default oil pallets on consoles we'll look at that mod description revised so he's yes done did quite an extensive revision of the uh, description uh, corrected errors in French translation fixed problem with unloading the pallets at the selling station and removed cotton from the sell point so no more cotton at the sell point so in case you were using that sell point to sell cotton you can't do that anymore <clears throat> right um, now, uh, costs, the mill, the production costs $60 a month. Um, purchase price of the selling station. <clears throat> uh, so corn oil and soybean oil was also added as new products. Um, corn oil was probably uh, on the first one. I don't remember exactly uh, at this time. Uh, pallet spawn has been moved slightly and expanded from 4 to 16 pallets. <laughs> But we have a little bit of an issue there, but I don't think it's anything serious. It's just a little bit, yeah, a little bit funny. Um, yes, so let's look at the production cycle, shall we? Let's go into our uh, sunflower. So the capacity for our incoming materials is actually 200,000 liters. Um and I have had this running for one month or one sleep and as you can see the production is quite good um, 17,000 cycles the olive oil is slightly lower at 12,000 cycles per month um, 2 to 1 is the ratio which is actually pretty good if you consider um, actual oil uh, extraction from sunflowers corn and so forth uh, probably that ratio is much lower or shall we say much higher than that as in much more corn uh, and take much more corn and these items to make 
It'd take more than two liters of sunflower seeds to make one liter of uh, sunflower oil, just in real life. So, very favorable recipe. Um, <clears throat> as you can see, the storage is not that big. So that could be an issue. Um, so I have turned them all on. And as you can see here, we have a lot of pallets of oil here. So this is... Looks like the soybean oil. Yes, soybean oil. Um, and the uh, they are actual weight. Um, it seems like they've kind of um, spawning a little bit helter-skelter, a little bit. Um, now, is that going to be a problem, perhaps, since they're not liftable? Uh, oh, wait a minute. Uh, the uh, olive oil is, because I have that mod. However, the, uh, what is this, uh, sunflower oil, yeah, I can pick that up because I have uh, the liftable pallet mod for, s for that, but, yeah, the soybean oil I will not be able to pick up here, it's still making, <laughs> it's still making olive oil, is that the olive oil, yeah, <laughs> hold on, let me, let me turn these off. And let's switch these to uh, distributing. <clears throat> right, so. Um, olive oil. Uh, if you have the liftable pallet mod, these that's why I'm able to lift these. If you don't, you're not going to be able to. But I'm trying to clear these off. Because I had them all running. So, I mean, yeah, typically... Um, you are maybe one or two of them you might run at simultaneously. Um, I don't usually like running um, more than one product in a facility because I like using auto load pal or auto load trailers. And actually, that's we're going to uh, see if any of the auto load trailers uh, pick up. The new products like this is the soybean oil here uh, this is a corn corn oil so the corn oil and the soybean oil I can't pick up because uh, it's a new product right so I've got those cleared off of there so we got corn oil and soybean oil here so that's what they look like. Kind of neat. I, I do like it. Um, you said the pallets have been adjusted. Uh, the corn oil is still a thousand liters, but it looks like they're... The corn and soybean oil are like look like three stack. Possibly? No? I don't know. I won't, I won't know till we start unloading or trying to pick them up and load them. Oh, there's some... There's some more here. Get that out of the way. <laughs> oh, can I move these with the... Oh, I can a little bit. The old trick moving uh, moving pallets with another pallet trick. <laughs> it looks like they're... Yes, they're definitely a three stack of... Uh, it's a three stack of the corn oil and soybean oil instead of the single stack type uh, but there's still a thousand liters in there so mm, that's kind of odd I think hmm uh, again nothing really game breaking um, right so I'm gonna go grab a couple things and we're gonna see what we can do with this and then uh, we can see what uh, we can do about selling it Okay, we'll be back in a second. All right, so um, here we are. Uh, I have taken actually with the forklift um, one of each of these and they sell very readily at the sell point there. We're just gonna test out, this is the logist uh, Lizard Logistics Big Bag Trailer by Raleigh, um, um, Raleigh Christie One VSR Modding Sir. And yes, look at that. It actually auto loads the corn oil 
very slickly as an as a matter of fact if we look into the trailers and go over to the big bag trailer it is see at the end there at the bottom right of the two the corn oil and soybean oil is actually actually listed now as something it will pick up so if you don't like fooling around with um, uh, with forklift and so forth and so on yeah auto load trailer no problem whatsoever and if we should be able to go over here and just uh, R1 and triangle there we go thirteen thousand uh, dollars for that one thousand or no I guess it was uh, two thousand liters yeah so pretty slick there um very nice uh let's go just grab a soybean that was the uh that was the corn oil by the way <clears throat> so let's see here we should be able to and the the pallets are look very easy to pick up there's no like they almost like just want to go on there it's actually very uh very easy and uh, there we go so it's automatically loading those uh those two two thousand liters of soybean oil let's go sell this <clears throat> and eighteen thousand dollars very nice uh, extremely nice actually because it only took so let's say 4,000 liters of soybeans so what are soybeans going for right now because that's how much uh, soybeans it took so 4, 8 yeah, so oh yeah I'm making a little bit more on the oil. Um, soybeans do sell for quite a bit. Um, three, so three, six, twelve. Yeah, a little bit more. I mean, not a huge amount more. Uh, the corn actually is uh, the producing corn oil is probably much more lucrative. If we look at the price of corn oil, six, sixty-seven hundred dollars per thousand liters it only takes two thousand liters of <clears throat> corn to make a thousand liters of corn oil so what's corn running at right now best price is 26 so two three four five five thousand per thousand liters and or five thousand per two yeah so mm, yeah um i would have liked to seen a little bit more uh, a little bit better price for the oils um i suppose but i hear i'm on fox farm so different maps could be um priced differently you'll have to keep your eye on that and uh you know judge for yourself whether um whether it's going to be profitable for you or not but anyways there you go i do believe that's caught all the um updates uh, as far as i can tell i perhaps i may have missed something um hopefully not and uh, there it is. That's the update to the extended oil plant by Jump Fruit. 4.94 uh, megabytes to download. And um, let's just check the slots right now. We're going to get out of there and uh, yeah, slot counts. What's our slot count? I don't remember. Oil mill. So there's a standard oil mill. There's the extended oil plant. 13 slots on console. There you go. Uh, thank you for watching. I'm Looney Farm Guy, and remember, 
it's only a game, so till next time, bye for now.